and welcome back to Art Medillo. In this tutorial we will be drawing the Terminator and the most I know about the Terminator is that he is part robot and he kills stuff. The materials that I'll be using today for this drawing are Sharpie, mechanical pencil, tan pencil, peach colored pencil, a black pencil, a red pencil, a dark brown pencil, and a light brown pencil. And of course, my big eraser. Guide papers that I had today to help me with the drawing and um, how to draw him like he was um, were these papers. So starting off, we're going to start with the um, just a basic outline of his uh, head and ears and where his coat collars are going to be and um, his jawline and just the basic outline of where his face is going to be. And then I use these other lines across his face to give me an idea where his eyes and nose and mouth are going to be. And I've kind of put in um, where his eyes and eyebrows are on here. And you can kind of see the collar. And now I'm adding in where the nose is going to be. And uh, just the basic shape of everything. And I'm adding in some more detail on uh, the eyes and um, on the hair a little bit. And now on his mouth. And it's good just to use these guidelines to um, help guide you, as uh, they're said. And um, just get where everything is going to go before you just start working on one part of the drawing. And so now I'm just adding in more lines and adding a little more detail into this first sketch of him. And um, now that I've got that little detail in, I'm using my Sharpie and I'm uh, just adding in um, all the, the lines where everything goes and all the other extra detail I will add. And uh, here I am just adding in his metal on his face and uh, his eyebrow in different spots on there. And then I'm just uh, doing the lines on his mouth and the wrinkles on around his mouth. And now I'm doing his hair and um, just uh, do, using, using straight lines because his hair doesn't really go in any other direction except along the sides. Um, that's more vertical and now I'm just um, adding in the um, his his coat and different uh, parts on his coat and um, adding in some more wrinkles and um, just a few more the little spots on his eye and uh, stuff, stuff like that and so now I'm going to use my eraser and just erase all of the lines that I no longer need since all I need is my ink drawing. And uh, so I'm going to use the peach color which works very well for skin colors. And um, I'm, I'm just coloring in all of his face. And this peach color is a little light for him so I'm going to eventually go back over that with a brown to make it more tan. Um, but for now, I'm just using this peach color um, for his uh, face. And if you don't have the right color that you would like, it is totally fine to just go and mix colors. And so here I'm uh, using my, um, my black and making that gray and silver um, where his, um, all the different parts of the metal is showing through. And then on the leather jacket, I did uh, little lines to help me guide where the, the folds and stuff were going to be in, um, in his jacket. And I made that, the outside a little bit darker um, in his jacket. And it's good to have um, folds like this with leather and not so um, defined, but more just um, subtly, um, subtle. Um, things for here and uh, it makes it better than like if it was a t-shirt leather it has less wrinkles and then that wasn't leather it was some other fabric that kind of looked like that so I just added in that there and then I just uh, added in the last bit of where that is 
And so then I got my brown, um, like I said, and I just went over his face, just over the entire thing, and um, just made it a little darker. Um, and around the wrinkles, I just made that even darker than the rest of it. And I'll go back over that with a darker um, brown eventually. And so now I'm just yeah, adding in a little bit more shadows. And then I am using a dark brown for his eyebrows and um, for the different wrinkles. And then I'm going over his hair. But his hair wasn't that dark, but I had another brown, but that was too light. So again, I mixed colors, made this dark one, and then I go back over that with um, brown. Same thing for his eye, because it, it wasn't a light brown, it wasn't a dark brown, it was a mix in between. And so I um, just used that light brown and colored back over the hair. On um, Just colored it right back over it. And um, then I just used a little bit more of the brown and went around that. And then I used my tan color for his shirt, and uh, that was just a basic... Uh, coloring and then I used my black and went back over it with shadow because the shadow is coming from that side and I just went over his whole head with um, the shadows going on that side and um, I'm just um, just getting that red and going around where um, the other ones were Please like and subscribe and if you want me to draw something for you, please leave it in the comment section down below and I will draw it as soon as I can.